Hey guys, welcome back to part 131 of the 100 baby challenge. So with the makeover in the last part, you're wondering what happened to Marisol and Dom. Well, let's just say I got lazy and I only want to focus on the Sims who are going to be hanging around the household for, you know, a much longer period of time rather than, you know, Sims are about to be moved out. So... Yeah, <laughs> and plus for me to jump into a stylist to make over one sim, it takes like 10 minutes just for everything to load up for all the different outfits. That's why I never do like formal wear, active wear, or swimwear. Only focus on the clothing that you guys see all the time. So hope that makes sense to you. So today is a graduation day and therefore no one in this household has school and I've actually decided to move out Marisol and Dom I wish I had done it the night before then that way all of our kids can still go to school but this was just a very impulse decision but it's okay it's definitely all right all right so I'm actually gonna have Marisol wake up uh, let's go ahead and move within this neighborhood uh, she is taking her sweet time. I wonder if the kids will still end up going to school if I end up moving them out. I kind of doubt it, but let's see. Alright, as for you, why don't you go ahead and grab some food? I believe a lot of our kids are going to be super duper hungry, but it's okay. We'll take care of them. Uh, so we're going to kick them out. Yes, yes, yes. Before, you know, Yasmin gets pregnant and then I'm just really stuck with everyone in this household until uh, they're all fully grown as a young adult. So, better safe than sorry. This will be the first move since coming into this town. So, it's, it's kind of sad but very exciting at the same time because we are making a lot of space. Alright, let me see if they end up having school. No. They're still off. They still don't have school. Which is fine. Totally fine. Alright. Why don't you go ahead and grab some food? Uh, eat leftover. Oh, and then also we are going to start the toddler training. Alright, let's go ahead and feed on floor. Uh, feed on floor. And, um, I think with what's his face? Malink? Uh, he's probably not gonna come over for like another, I wanna say 13 and a half hours because that's when he gets off from work at that little park festival. Crystal seems like she is going to be a bit snippy today. Well, well, I don't have anything to say. <laughs> um, but let's actually quickly scope out the town. Let's see. Uh, if there's anyone out that we can go hit up. No, Stuart is a female. Who's this? Oh, this is so, this is where the swan end up moving to. Oh. Or, I mean, you know, Marisol and Dom. <gasps> Mackenzie. No, we're not going to take a free vacation. Let's actually go visit the Mackenzie household. Let's just introduce ourselves before... Oh, ooh, and this guy's home. All right, I have a feeling they might be home for a while, so let's actually grab some food before we head out. Grab some autumn salad. And then for Kyle, let's have you clean up these bathrooms. All right, who is this? Uh, Stefan. We can definitely put Stefan in the walker. Ooh, my nose is getting itchy. Alright, so we got in the mail those imaginary dolls that I am going to completely ignore just due to the fact that it does uh, glitch out my toddlers. I don't know why. You know, all this time I still don't know why. But I am going to get another, another party. Look at me stuck for words. <laughs> um, but I feel like one party is never enough. Actually, let's, yeah, let's do that. Alright, is she eating? Yes, okay, I think we're good. We can probably head out. Let's go visit the Mackenzie household. 
Oh no, he left. I hope he stays in his house. I really. Oh my god. I think that's him. I think that is him. Where is he going? Let's actually follow him. <laughs> We're such a stalker, dude. Wait, where is this? Is that his house? Uh, let's do a friendly introduction. I don't know what place this is. Let me double check. Oh, he went to the gym. Wow, I've never thought about going to the gym. See, everything is in freaking Russian that I don't know what it is. And I have yet to take the time to actually rename everything. So, but at least luckily we followed him. We know this is where he went. Wait, where's he going? Dude, hold on. I think we're gonna have to follow him again. He like faked going to the gym and he left his car there. What the hell? Unless he's going to work or maybe going to the city hall. I don't know. All right, so he did go here. Dude, this guy is like, wait, is he going to work? Dude, this sucks. <laughs> I so failed. All right, where else can we meet some peeps? Yeah, all these houses are like unoccupied. I don't know why. Um, uh, you know what? You know what? Just just chill there for a moment. Let me take care of little stuff in here. All right, let me to learn how to walk. All right, and then and then. I think everyone's pretty good. Let's actually have her clean up. All right, we're gonna go about this one more time. Let's see if there's anyone at this little park. Oh, ooh, who's that? Is that a guy? Yes, it is. Let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction. This guy is called Lane Clemenson. Huh? <clears throat> Interesting. Alright, um, uh, is there anybody else just wandering around town? I really don't see anybody. Not at all. Alright, at least we have one person. We have one person. I should be thankful. <laughs> I should be very thankful. He has a funky looking nose. Hey, where are you going? Don't tell me you're a paparazzi. Alright, so I guess we'll just go ahead and get to know him. Show funny videos, tell funny story. And for some reason, all of the people we meet as acquaintances, they we have a pretty like good standing relationship with them, which I don't know why. Alright, so promised midlife crisis wishes cannot be cancelled. So her midlife crisis is to want to flirt with a lane here it's totally achievable all right we'll go ahead and do that let's do ah, i'm just gonna cue her uh -huh. up to do and a whole bunch of funny interactions to get to know him funny uh show internet cat video and then we'll throw in one flirt all right so daryl has learned how to potty train while stuff and learn how to walk perfect let me go back to our household and swap the duties around. Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right, let's actually have you come here, help me empty these out. Um, are you hungry? No. Uh, this is Daryl. I'm gonna go ahead and put Daryl into the walker. And then we're gonna go ahead and pick up a stuffing. So, Jasmine should be preoccupied with all those interactions. Oh yeah, she's nowhere near to the last one where I had her flirt. Alright, go ahead and clean. And then we're gonna go ahead and potty train. Uh, Stefan. Right? Yeah, Stefan. We're picking up Stefan, so we're gonna potty train Stefan. I'm like, <laughs> so confused. Why can we not? Hold on. Did he end up walking to... Yes. I don't know why these kids do that. They always end up 
walking to like a little corner and it just drives me nuts all right pick up stuff in and we're gonna go ahead and party train wow you help me mop up this puddle all right so party train stuff in and then oh no 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 what happened oh <gasps> where'd he go what the freaking hee haw we want to flirt with lane i think the last thing was clementine clementine where do you live clementine hello is that him no that's myers that's our daughter and son where the hell did he go? All right, you know what I'm gonna do? Just for the sake of finding these people, I'm gonna turn on my map tag to everyone. Show map tag, uh, uh, all. All right. Clementine, where did he go? Oh, that's Malik. That's Pierre. Am I going blind or do I not see him? All right, let me try inviting him over. Oh, we're actually friends with him. <laughs> Hope he's not at work. Yes, he's coming over. Go home, girl. Go home. <laughs> Go home. All right, create an elixir. I think we'll we'll do that next time. Uh oh, I thought we had another interaction, another wish to see Stefan age up well. All right, hopefully he's not there waiting for us. Actually, something suddenly came up. Oh my God, what a butthole! <laughs> what a butthole, dude. Oh, I thought he was good to come over. Like, why? 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 Invite over. Alright, do we have bills? No. So we don't have bills on? Good. Oh, let me queue up a little uh, Daryl here to learn how to walk. So this part has so far started off as a complete a fail in trying to get guys to come over. Alright, he said he's coming over, but I don't know if he's going to stick by his words. I really don't think so. What are you doing? Go bathroom, you're in front of the toilet. Oh, you know why? Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I have my free will turned off. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Oops. <gasps> is that him? Yes, it is him. Perfect. Alright, uh, let's do compliment personality. So I guess we are just going to get pregnant with uh, Lane here. Because there's nothing else, uh, nobody else we can hook up with. I don't want to get to know the paparazzi while they're in the paparazzi status, just in case. Just in case something goes wrong. Alright, let's try flirting. Hope he's not our love interest. What the hell was that? <laughs> Why do we have so many paparazzis in our lot? I don't get that. Alright, so we flirted. Let's go ahead and try for a baby. Let's see how this works out. And as for Malik, screw you, we'll, we'll target you as our next baby daddy. Alright, so Daryl learned how to walk, which is perfect. How about potty training? Uh, okay, so... Stefan is still learning how to potty train. It's gonna take a little while. Are you guys going in to try for a baby? Yes. Why? Do we need to? Oh my god! Seriously. Seriously. <laughs> All right, a little Daryl. Let's have you walk over here. 
I'm gonna have your sister pick you up. And then ask for Stefan. Stefan should learn how to potty train already. I don't know. Alright, so we're gonna dive right into this. Dive right into this. I don't know if I mentioned this, but when I gave Yasmin the makeover, my intentions were to make her look more mature. But I feel like the makeover I did actually make her look a lot younger. I don't know. That's what I feel like, but that's for you guys to judge too. Alright, um, perfect. So we have party trained. Stefan, which means we can go ahead and age them up. I'm gonna have them both come over here. Hey, hey. Did you really put your. Really? Alright, go ahead and uh, pick up Daryl. Holy shit. Alright, so we are, in fact, Bregos. Let's go and ask to leave. <laughs> nice to know you. What I wanna be ya. Oh, and then as for her lifetime wish, let me go ahead and change that now. Because this is pre-recorded, so I don't know if you guys left any comments regarding to choosing her lifetime wish. So I'm just gonna go ahead and choose one. A lifetime wish, yes. Uh, no, what is this? The fairy tale of finder. Nah. I was actually thinking about doing this one, the alchemy artisan. I think this is achievable based on you know besides making procreation elixirs. Uh, we can make a whole bunch of other stuff. I think it's doable. Let me see what other options. We can choose as our lifetime wish. Uh, da, da, da. No, I think I'll go with this alchemy artisan. Alright. Wait, 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 who's crying? Alright, so let me go ahead and age up. Who is this? Uh, Stefan. Oh, let me turn on my cheats. Do, 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 do. And then uh, we're gonna go and age up. Wait, what? Did I turn it on right? Uh, hold on. Don't go anywhere, little man. Wait, testing cheats enabled. True. Is it me or is it not working? Okay, there we go. Trigger H, and I know we're gonna get. Dude, who the hell keeps putting uh, Daryl into the freaking playpen? It's driving me nuts. I wanna put a half or put Daryl down here. I mean, Stefan. <laughs> so, uh, Stefan here is heavy sleeper, grumpy, and da da da. Equestrian. Oh, that's interesting. All right, put Daryl down. Put a little Daryl down here. Come on. And then we're gonna go ahead and age uh, Daryl up. It is a Daryl's birthday. All right. So, how's everyone else doing? I think everyone's. Ooh, goodness gracious. You know how to play game, but you don't know how to go use a toilet. Smart. Very smart. <laughs> Alright, so Daryl is insane, couch potato, and da da da! Star quality. I guess if you're a star, you could be a little insane. I guess it could make sense. <laughs> I guess so. Alright, uh. Everyone seems to be getting hungry. Let's go ahead and get everyone fed. And, ooh, you need to use the toilet. 
All right, so I'm just gonna feed everyone. And then as far as the house goes, I just kind of really feel like maybe remodeling this whole entire house and just live with it. Cause I, I've been really lazy to build anything, so I don't know, we'll see. But let me put in the alchemy station. I guess I'll put it in over here. Yeah, why not? This is probably the worst combination of kids play toys and some very hazardous, dangerous poison. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and tend the garden. Uh, let me see what Stefan looks like with his everyday outfit. So that will be a uh, debate of whether I will give them a makeover. Actually, I'm okay with that outfit. Let's see what his outfit looks like. Every day. Swish. Yeah, I'm okay with that. So I'm not going to jump into the makeover for these two. Like I said, it just takes a really long time. And I just haven't had the patience lately to do any of that. Alright, did we have her read the Procreation Elixir book? Yes, we did. Alright. Uh, I'm actually gonna have her research alchemy. Maybe we can learn how to make that jar of friendship. Or we can actually just go to the elixir store and purchase the book if it's available. That would be like, you know, the easiest way to do it. Alright, so... Um, uh, pretty much nothing is gonna happen at this point. I'm gonna put everyone to bed off camera, and then, uh, I'm probably gonna have he asked me work on researching the alchemy, uh, potions and ingredients and such, and then, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part. It was kind of messy, <laughs> but like always, thank you for watching. Hope you all have a wonderful day. Don't forget to comment, rate, or subscribe if you haven't already because you're not going to regret it. And I will talk to you guys in the next part. Bye, guys.